sure to hit that like button, everyone. And if you're not subscribed, please do subscribe to my channel and also enable those notifications. happy we finally made it to Dallas Glacier so for, for all those who follow me uh, this is my sixth time and only my third time actually seeing it which is wonderful so we're anytime you can make it consider it a lucky day <laughs> so uh, pretty So this is the least amount of ice I've ever seen. Oh really? Yeah, it is not icy at all, yeah, which no, is really good. We've, seen, we've been to places where there's been a lot more ice. Yeah. So yeah, like usually there's ice like everywhere here, so we can even get this. Okay, like, that's good, maybe you'll drive right up. There. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I think we'll probably get to the edge of that mountain right there. Hopefully a little bit close, maybe not that close, but you know, because you need to time this, you know, space to spin yeah. around. But yeah, maybe a little bit more. This looks so good. that there's not much ice here. Usually it's like an ice field. Look at how beautiful that is with the sun shining. Yeah, yeah, now we're doing a turn, they'll stop off on that little side, we'll see it, and then we'll just we'll head out. Alright, have a good day. You. Yeah, you bet. Take care. <laughs> we are turning. Cool. Look at this shot right here. We are turning left. Dog Glacier, it's absolutely beautiful. Fall all year round here. So all that snow doesn't have time to melt because summer is so very short in Alaska, only lasting a couple of weeks. So the vast remainder of snow every year, it turns into ice, it turns into glaciers. Hold those down these mountains with the harsh weight of a thousand winters. However, <clears throat> times are changing. A lot of news lately about global warming or climate change. 95% of the 100,000 glaciers in Alaska of varying sizes today are melting or in retreat. Uh, to simplify a glacier, it's very much like your checkbook. The total amount of ice is determined by how much is being spent. The ice shed on the front end compared to how much is being saved the snowfall on the back end up in the mountains if more ice falls off the front and it is deposited its income on the back end then the glacier shrinks which is too often now the case in our era of climate change 
Okay, we're officially turning. We're gonna head out, but what an amazing stay here today. Wow, Captain Tony and his team did a phenomenal job. I've never stayed at Dawes Glacier this long before. <laughs> So I'm super happy with Princess Cruises. Thank you. John Muir came up here in the inside passage of Alaska. He explored this country in an open canoe in October. Wow. Uh, it was John Muir who was the first person to prove the theory of glaciation. It was glaciers, rivers and waters that carved out not only these northern canyons. Look at that sunray coming down. It looks absolutely beautiful. Shining on the water there. You got the sparkly diamond. This is amazing. This is probably one of my favorite Dawes Glacier visits ever. Uh, you know, like I said, this is my sixth time to end the Carnarvon Dawes Glacier. I only made it three times. But this one is probably the best just because of the, the cloud conditions, the sun, the experience, how close we actually got to it. And it's not too bad uh, with the ice conditions here as well. So now we are slowly. Now we're taking off. Now we're heading out. Yeah. That was awesome. Experience. He's pulling that whole thing around. How are you? Beautiful. Off we go. Until next time. Hopefully, Dawes Glacier. <laughs> <laughs> So the naturalist on board said, how can we, how can we improve this place, you know, by doing what? And he said, nothing. Let nature be and everything will be good. Amazing. Oh guys, what an amazing sixth experience here. Uh, never gotten this close to it before and there's not much ice, which is really nice. So yeah, pretty excited for this. What a, what a great, what a great morning. And yeah, there you go. And the Karan, the last glacier, gotta love it. It's like mosquitoes everywhere. <laughs> Why a dog's glacier? All right, guys, there you have it. Uh, another amazing experience and visit to Dawes Glacier at Rueda Garan. Uh, again, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. And uh, if you have any questions or comments below, please let me know. Until next time, guys, this is Grizzly with JT officially signing off from Endicott Arm and Dawes Glacier. Take care. And a special shout out to all my Patreon and YouTube members. Thank you so much for your additional support. If you'd like to become a Patreon or YouTube member, I'll include the links in the description below. It's basically a behind the scenes view of cruising with JT and special access to various benefits and perks and inside information into my upcoming videos. So if you do decide to join, I truly appreciate your support. This video is sponsored by MEI Travel. Feel free to reach out to me at cruisingwithjt at gmail.com and I'll get you connected to my travel agent at MEI Travel. She'll take great care of you. And I'll also include the information in the description below. Thank you so much. <music>